Keywords in Context provides the phrase and paragraph for each occurrence of a keyword. This keyword can be toggled by selecting any word in a panel, such as Cirrus, Corpus Reader, or words in the entire document. By default, only the phrase the keyword appears in is visible. To view the entire paragraph, select the plus sign to the left of the phrase for the expanded view. Besides the three default columns, left, keyword, and right, other column options are available. Hovering over any of the column titles will reveal a down arrow. Clicking on this arrow opens a further menu. In this menu, hovering over columns will display the other two options, document and position. To toggle either of these columns, select the column name. Similarly, to untoggle any of the present columns, select the column name again. The panel's lower toolbar provides many functions. A navigation tool allows the user to move between multiple pages of results. A refresh icon will refresh the panel. Context provides a drop-down menu which allows the user to specify the number of words that are displayed on either side of the phrase in which the keyword appears. Preview provides a drop-down menu which allows the user to specify the number of words that are displayed in the extended paragraph view. A search field is also provided. Once the user begins typing, the field will suggest other similar words. As well, the user can add results to a favorites list that allows easy feature access to the phrase. To add a phrase to the favorites list, first select it, then select the favorites list addition icon. This icon is in the form of a heart with a green circle. The favorites list icon toggles between the regular view and the phrases already added to the list. This is the heart icon. In the upper toolbar, Keywords and Context has two important icons. The help icon provides a short description and a link to more documentation. The export icon provides a link to the specific instance of the tool, possibilities for embedding the tool, a citation format, as well as possibilities for exporting the information generated by the tool as tabular data in plain text, comma-separated values, tab-separated values, or in XML.